Shaul Hevet is a small Jewish school of just 252 students here in Los Angeles, but you only need five players on a basketball court. And their girls team, led by coach Ryan Coleman, has done the improbable. Shaw Havitt won the Division Four state championship in Sacramento, avenging a loss in the title game a year ago. Here's our Joe Pena Lopez, who sat down with the team to find out what makes their school and their team so special. Hometown Hero, sponsored by Rotolo Chevrolet. You guys won every tournament you played in this year. At what point did you feel like we have what it takes this year to win the state title? Last year, like losing to San Domenico definitely like motivated us to get back to where we are today. Like having that feeling of like we wanted revenge and like we wanted to get back. People thought we were like out of our minds for saying that we would go back to Sacramento two years in a row, but we did it. You guys already have the state title banner up. You're getting rings. As did a ceremony at the school. You're being honored really by the city council. They're the first Jewish school in California history to win a CIF championship in any sport, boys or girls. UCLA women's basketball uh, team is honoring you guys. What is all that like? Feels great. Yeah, it feels amazing. Insane. Um, experiences of a lifetime. We're gonna remember this forever. Like realistically, not to be like a Debbie Downer, but like this isn't happening again. Like, not to be that person, but like last year, we're like, okay, we're coming back, and we did come back. So we finally got it, and we achieved what we've been working for. Since the day we lost in Sacramento, we all got on that plane, and we were literally depressed, and we said we're coming back. Like, no matter what it takes, we will put in, like, so much work to get here, and we did it. How does a school of 252 students, and it's a co-ed school, find enough talented girls basketball players to win a state championship. A small Jewish school, it seems unfathomable. It is unfathomable. Um, you know, I think that the easiest thing for me is that my philosophies are aligned with the morals and values of the school, and that's empowering the kids. And when you find a group, even a small group of teenagers who believe in the same things that you believe in and dream the same things that you dream of and you empower them, uh, great things can happen and, and I'm fortunate enough to have a group of girls that really believed in themselves and achieved something unbelievable. Their excitement is crazy. I think it brings our community together in a lot of ways. Uh, if you saw the footage of our students watching the game in the gym, it was, uh, it was on fire in here. They feel they're, they're part of one larger community and the girls are representing them uh, on the court. What do you think this championship means to not only the school but the Jewish community? That is something that, that's hard for me to grasp. I'm still pinching myself and still sending text messages to the girls, you know, did this really happen? Uh, we're getting treated like royalty. We have so many people that have supported us throughout the season and more people that have interest in our team now. And I think that it opens up a lot of avenues and dreams to younger kids and the next generation. Because we're such a small Jewish school, us winning not only re represents like the Shalhavi community, but the larger Jewish community as a whole, and the Jewish communities across the country as well.